All right, guys, well, welcome back to the channel. <clears throat> I know it's been a few months since I last did a, my uh, RBP power step video, and I had a couple comments uh, regarding uh, some of the other mods that I was planning to do at the time, <clears throat> and I have since done quite a few of them. Um, and I'm going to do this is probably going to be a four part series uh, on this truck. Uh, and the first part, um, I think, is probably the biggest mod that I've done. Uh, since I did the, the power steps and I'll go ahead and show you that right now Cat skin leather So this is the full interior package front and back with the console It's a mahogany face with black backing and perforated seat pads and back pad it's really nice. I actually think it's better quality than the factory by far. <clears throat> I had a uh, I had a King Ranch Ford F-150 prior to this, and I just didn't like the all black look. So I think this, uh, although it doesn't, you know, completely mimic uh, a King Ranch leather, uh, it's about as close as you're going to get in the uh, in the Silverado. I'll show you the back. So I have the uh, the rear seat with the storage compartments, and they're fully done as well. And then the flip down. So I think if you're planning to uh, to upgrade your interior from cloth to leather, you really can't go wrong with it with Catskin. The shop that I had do this actually struggled with one part of this and it was the, the console cover um, apparently they work with most uh, dealerships and so people buy lower option trucks and then get the leather installed and then get it rolled up into their loan or their purchase price of their vehicle and so they send them to this shop and so they this is a, a basically a mass cat skin installer and uh Apparently they had never done one that wasn't a factory color before and so they couldn't figure out how to get the console cover off um, Which was crazy to me. And so I, I brought it home and uh, it took me like 10 minutes to get this console cover off you basically pull this little rubber piece out uh, And then you can get access to a couple Torx screws in here and then you can get this top piece off which will give you access to the hinges of this console cover and you basically have to pull a pin there's a little cotter pin on this side you pull that out or pull it off and then you slide the the uh the bar or the pin out from this direction obviously you got to put your seat up in order to do that then once you do that the console cover comes right off um, so then i actually had um, a neighbor that does some auto refinishing uh, and he covered the the console lid for me so I'm pretty happy with the way that this looks I like the brown color and the quality like I said I, I think it's better than factory by far give you another look at it So again, if you're looking to upgrade to uh, your cloth to leather, I don't think you can go wrong with cat skin.